Apple's Worldwide Developer Conference is going on right now. They've already unveiled a bunch of new software updates. Our tech reporter Jordan Hogan breaks down the lengthy list. Apple isn't holding anything back with this year's updates, including ones for your phone, watch, tablet, and computers. Let's start with iOS 14. This iPhone update includes tons of new features. App Library will now sit at the last page of your home screens, putting suggested apps and recently added ones at the top, followed by categorized ones based on the app types. Next up are widgets. These are bigger home screen views of your apps. They give you more details without opening the apps fully. A new feature many people are excited about is Picture in Picture. This lets you start playing a video and keep playing it up over other apps. Apple also went the extra mile by redesigning Siri. The smart assistant no longer takes up as much screen space and you can keep viewing other things. The new iOS also comes with its own Translate app that works offline and automatically detects languages in a two-way conversation. Messages is also getting upgrades including pinnable conversations, mentions and inline replies. The Maps app will have a few handy new features like guides for when you're visiting new places, cycling routes, electric vehicle charging routing, and congestion mapping. Speaking of apps, App Clips will let you use basic features of an app without downloading it using near-field connectivity or a QR code. So think things like scooter rentals. Digital car keys will also be added to iOS 14 and the previous software of iOS 13 starting next year. Next up is watchOS 7. Watch faces will now be shareable through things like messages, websites, and social media. watchOS 7 will also track your sleep without the need for a third-party app. A neat and timely feature is the automatic hand washing detection. It starts a 20 second countdown timer and if you finish early, you will be told to keep washing. WatchOS 7 also adds four new workout types. They are core training, dance, functional strength training and cool down. Next up is iPadOS 14. Scribble lets you write in any text field and have it automatically converted to typed text. Data detectors now work with handwritten notes to recognize phone numbers, dates, and addresses. Last up is macOS Big Sur. The new operating system for Apple computers and laptops includes the biggest Safari browser update. There are also updates to messages, maps, and privacy, similar to what they did with the iPhone software update. Apple also announced they are ditching Intel processing chips in their future computers for their own Apple silicone ones instead. They claim these new chips will make their tech perform better and use less battery power at the same time. Apple's Worldwide Developer Conference wraps up on June 26th. If you miss anything in this quick run through, don't worry, I'll post everything on our website, fox13now.com. In studio, Jordan Hogan, Fox 13 News, Utah.